Welcome creatures of all stripes and persuasions. You have entered the dude zone. We got some cool stuff to show you today. First thing we want to show is uh, <clears throat> how fast we're working on Thune World, the next gigantic volume of Nexus, all new Nexus material. This is the page right here. It's got some wacky layout going on here, as you can see. And there's a cast of thousands on the bottom, just to uh, make sure we measure up the previous books. A lot of work goes into every page. Even though these pencils are very loose, <clears throat> they're very important. <clears throat> Another thing that you've been dying to see, no, it's not the ABC news about the dude show. We're still waiting word and holding out for more money. <clears throat> Remember the page that uh, is going to be the creme de la creme of Thune World, where Fred's fighting a thousand Philistines with a jawbone of a... It's not an ass, it's something else. <clears throat> but it might as well be an ass, though. There's a lot of asses out there. <clears throat> you ready for this one right here? It's done, it's done. Here we go. The most proudest achievement of my career right here is this page right here. Was this easy to do? Ha <laughs> are you kidding? But I broke it down into steps, and that's how I even managed to get through it. But look at all the stuff that goes on there in, in a page. These are two gigantic pieces of paper all uh, taped together, like all two-page spreads are. And you've got to draw it, perspective it, um, research it, and <clears throat> finally ink it. So believe me, this is, uh, this is not for the weak of heart. And there's a little story going on in virtually everything that I've, that I've done here. Uh, we're always purchasing new art supplies. These are hake brushes, or if you're being a snob, you can call them hockey. Hakey? You know, you, we've all seen these brushes right here. The Chinese make them. These are for watercolor. And I see some of my favorite watercolorist working with these things on YouTube. So, of course, I had to get one, too. A whole bunch of them. You can see from behind me here that <coughs> this is a Nexus family portrait. <coughs> this is something I did a while ago, and uh, <coughs> believe it or not, there's very little reference used in this thing. It took me two weeks to do it. Nowadays, nowadays it would probably take me three to four weeks. So we're really slowing down in our old age here. Um, <coughs> so this is, a, this is a print that we're selling here, and I hope that uh, I believe that no, no home should be without it. A couple more um, things of note here. We all know Sunny Honey from Nexus, Sunder Peel. This was done in pastel. Um, I used the model for this right here. Her name was Jennifer. And I took a lot of liberties <coughs> and uh, made up a lot of the lighting on her. But it was, it was very good. This is done in new pastel. Something I should get back into because this is, it's, it's got a beautiful effect to it. And I haven't worked with it in a while, but... <coughs> Boy, I wonder if I could even match what I did here. The tones are so exacting and, and smooth, and there's a lot of glow to this piece right here. <clears throat> so we've got that. Finally, <clears throat> the one that you want to keep right above your fireplace, the mantle of your fireplace. This is the Nexus um, painting in oil based on <clears throat> the statue that Dark Horse put out some years ago. What a beautiful piece right here. It's just huge. This thing is like, uh, <clears throat> let me check my sheet here. It's 22 by 30. Can you believe that? Well, if you can't, it's right here in front of your eyes. So we've got all these things for sale right here. We're very excited about it. Um, <clears throat> so uh, I think that's it for right now for, for the, uh, the hard sell or the soft sell, which I prefer doing. And uh, keep the faith. Thune World is, uh, is proceeding full speed ahead. And I thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.